Hello and welcome to Mr Ridley's Design and Technology. In this sheet we're looking at um, developing our design ideas for our Design and Technology um, NEA coursework and we're looking at a sheet here which I've called Orthographic Drawing and Parts List. Um, it's number 12 in the um, series of ones that I've drawn but it, it, it's, it's part of this. So it's part of Section D, Developing Ideas. There are 20 marks for this, not for this sheet, but for this section. And that is as many marks as there are for making the product, which is realisation, the next section. And it is very important to, to maximise these marks and to try and make get to this, this top band here. So the top band says detailed development work, excellent modelling, fully appropriate materials and components selected um, about their working properties, fully detailed manufacturing specification. So this lists things like um, measured drawings, cutting and parts lists. They're actually mentioned here in the specification. So what do we have on this sheet? Well, we have a measured drawing, we have a, a formal what the example would call a formal drawing that's using um, orthographic drawing and using the correct conventions. We've got the three views and we've got some dimensions here. Then we've got a parts list with materials selected. Um, what we haven't got here is a justification for the material but that will come along on a different sheet and um, we'll look at that later. Then we've got some sizes and the parts required. We've got a little CAD drawing that I've added there just to, we had that CAD drawing anyway, but it, it, you could number these parts. It would be good practice to say number one, and you could do that on here so you could always number which parts they are just to add in, an added cross-reference cross because this sheet would um, constitute a, um, I think what we'd call a manufacturing um, a, a sort of manufacturing specification I think that's the, the words of the exam board so this would give us the specification we need really from this sheet alone someone um, with reasonable skills could probably manufacture the product and then we've got look and the last thing we've put here so we've talked about the CAD drawing here and we've also talked about a bit of development we could have added a summary here to talk about a little bit more justification I think that would have been nice as well on this sheet um, and then we've looked at boarding components. So for this, this particular thing, which is a garden light, we've got a solar panel, which will be fitted to the side there, and we've got a solar lighting circuit. So it's just saying about those, um, the, the, again, the justification of the components, justification of the parts are saying about the warm, warm white LED rather than a cool white LED. So we, all the time we're justifying... Um, you know, it's, it's re research, working properties, those words there that are in the top band here of the mark scheme. So there, there's, a, again, a formal parts list laid out. There's our orthographic drawing, and that is the orthographic drawing and parts list sheet. So thank you for watching Mr Ridley's Design and Technology.